Okay, blast from the past here, and today we're going to talk about Canadian currency. I have a few Canadian pieces. This is just a little bit of what I got. Um, just some cool stuff for you to look at. What we're going to talk about first is the Canadian dollars. And so here's a couple of them. Here's the maple leaf, which is pretty cool, uncirculated. Awesome, right? I know. This is a bullion coin. It's made out of 0.999 silver. It's awesome. This is a, what I think is what they're using right now. This right here is a silver coin I picked up from a coin shop. It's a proof coin. It's pretty cool. It has like, like a cow head or something on it. On the back it has the queen. The queen! Yeah. And this is another older dollar. It has that lady on it from the leather one. And this has a duck. And it says a dollar can Canadian Canada. Canada! I mean Canada. And then this right here is the Winnipeg hundred dollar whatever. It's a commemorative coin. I just picked this up. It wasn't that expensive. It was like really cheap. Looks cool though. And then this is a 50 cent piece there. It's actually 80% silver. It's pretty cool. Yeah. It's from 1862, which is pretty cool. Okay, now we're going to talk about some quarters. And so, for a whole bunch of years, I thought this was junk, which is pretty cool that it's not. I mean, it's still junk silver, but it's worth something. These coins right here, if you can see, this one and then these other two stacks right here, these are actually silver coins. If you, if you don't know, from 18, 1968 and down, Canada made 80% silver coins. And then they stopped and they made, uh, I think, steel and, and copper. But I always thought these were junk. I just had them in a big sack with my other Canadian quarters that I collected. And so that's pretty cool because these are actually like worth, I don't know, about five bucks maybe a piece, which is pretty awesome. Melting value, of course. These are painted Canadian quarters. These are, let's see, that's the poppy quarters, which is pretty cool. I just picked those up. They're really cheap. Then we got our dimes. These are pretty cool. They have a ship on one side. This one does at least. This one's really older. It has some guy on it. Yeah. And then these are also 80% silver. You can probably pick them up for like uh, $2 pop. Then we go down here to the large cents. Canada had a whole bunch of different types of uh, large cent pennies. Yeah. Until this is the the new one right now well the one that they're using right now it's the uh, maple leaf on the back with the queen on the front but let's go back to these ones yeah these ones are really old I picked these ones actually up in a garage sale for like I don't know 50 cents man but these are pretty cool because they're like really old this one's the, actually the oldest it's from 1837 and it has this this dude walking on it I don't know if you can see it kind of see it right there and then this like O on the background with like this weird ass design which is pretty cool this one right here has the queen on it and, I, and if you guys know who that guy is or you know who these people are because I'm not I'm not from Canada so I don't really know the history about all this stuff. So, and you can tell me what what boat this is. If this is that'd be really cool because there's this boat on it. And then this one is pretty old. They're, they're all from the 1800s. This one right here has another dude on it. And on the back, it has an eagle. It says one penny. This one right here, it says one penny. And I'm not positive this is from Canada, 
but it just looks really old, and it was with the, the three. I found the other three on eBay, and they were going for, like, I don't know, 16 bucks a pop. But I want to know what, what this guy, what the, what's the deal with this coin? If you let me know. You know. Yeah, it's from, it's from actually 1921. And it looks pretty cool. Yeah, let's go over everything I pretty much have right here. Oh. Just a little bit of them. I just bring out like one of each or a few of each of them. So you guys can get a look at the different ones I have. And uh, I would like to know about a little bit, if you guys know a little bit out of it, uh, about these coins. Uh, please comment and subscribe. Alright, this is Blast from the Past.